In this day and age, it seems you have to be an executive, a politician, or a celebrity to have your voice heard. I am none of these. I am not a country or a machine. I don't fit into an era. I don't pretend. I don't lie. And if you listen, you can hear my voice. It is plain and simple. It is strong. And I have a great history. I am your history. There is a new revolution taking place. And if you listen, you can hear my voice heard in abandoned cities and vacant lots, small backyards and large porches, rooftops and on sidewalks. And what I'm growing is diverse as each of your personalities, cultures, likes and dislikes. There is a freedom in my life, in what I'm growing and where I have evolved. It's changing though. You might know, but you might not know that you are changing too. I have shared with you the grains, vegetables, and meat that have given birth to your evolution from a single cell to a complex human being. You have taken from my soils everything you needed, and I gave it to see you live. But my voice will not support what will kill me and what will begin to kill you too. A seed is a unit of life. I created them as a promise to you for food, for wealth, for sustenance, and for your future. Seeds spread life through and within all the niches of this world. From mountain tops to fields afar, plants grow and flourish. But you are changing this unspoken agreement, and seeds are no longer units of life. Those of you would take the life out of seeds, corrupting the purpose, and then use it against each other for the benefit of a few. As you began to own land, you owned me. Now you own my seeds, buying patents on life cycles of seeds, buying my life. I own the seed, and it is not yours to own. In the cracks of concrete, in backyard gardens, and small rooftop oases, in the vacant lots that now grow my new intentions, this is my voice. I am speaking out now, and you will hear my voice not just in the thunderstorms of challenge and the winds from the sky, but in my way, I'll fight your negligence. Gardeners, young and old, these are the caretakers of my seeds that each day are protecting the diversity and integrity I intended. Those are who will protect your future now, when the seeds you misaligned for your own purpose begin to fail and give you results you have yet to see. Only then will you listen to my voice. Only then.